these rocks, when they come in from uh, typically from asteroids, they're bone dry and cold. They're not hot when they land, which is kind of a, a misunderstanding. The environment, the surface of the Earth is completely alien to these rocks. Few things are as exciting as seeing a meteor streaking across the sky. But for some scientists, what's even more interesting is what makes it to the ground. The problem is finding them can take days or even weeks. I've heard estimates that something, you know, the size of a grapefruit makes it to the ground somewhere across the surface of the Earth every five days or, or the equivalent sort of thing. But of course, the Earth is two thirds water and we don't actually occupy that much of the Earth's uh, surface or, you know, in other words, there are not many people there to witness it. That's where these new state of the art all sky cameras in central Alberta come into play. They'll allow for the automated detection of meteorite dropping fireballs in Western Canada. That's the, the key piece of information is how long is that fireball and when did it start and when did it end? And that allows you to better calculate and basically triangulate. You're literally triangulating this, this fireball in the sky, triangulate its trajectory and then predict where the meteorites have fallen. Not only can they help track where a meteorite landed, it can also tell researchers where in space it came from. On top of that, it can notify them of a meteor strike within an hour of the event happening. That means that the sample is as pristine, almost as pristine as possible. We can get it into our facility like the one that we have here. Um, and we know where it comes from in the solar system. We basically have everything that we need to get started on, a, on analyzing this rock that has all this great information. While amateur astronomers keep watching the sky, hoping for that rare glimpse of a meteor, just remember there's a new fireball network in place to make sure we don't miss a thing. So if somebody calls me the next morning and says, I think I spot a fireball, I'll be like, yeah, I know, we know, we got it. In Calgary, Jonathan Muma, City News.